How's it going everyone? Uh, today we're going to be doing something a little uh, non-traditional. We're not actually going to be fishing today, but we're going to be sampling for a federally endangered species, fish species, called the Topeka Shiner. Topeka Shiners prefer these kind of slack water, backwater uh, oxbow habitats. So right now two of the techs are hauling a seine through the water through this oxbow. Um, and an oxbow is basically remnants of where the stream bed used to lie. So a normal stream meanders and when it finally comes back on itself uh, there's this nice U-shaped uh, pond basically it's called an oxbow and that's where these Topeka Shiners uh, like to hang out. See any Topekas? Once we have the seine net finally pulled in, uh, it's kind of crucial that we get all these fish into buckets with aerators going as soon as possible to try and reduce uh, the number of mortalities that we have. As you can see, we have thousands of fish, and generally speaking, it's inevitable that we'll get some mortalities, um, but we really try and do everything we can to reduce uh, mortalities, especially on um, Topeka Shiners. Most of these fat heads. There's a Topeka. No way. First Topeka. Oh. Lost him, bro. Oh, is that an orange spot? Oh, yeah, probably. That's a pretty nice one. Yeah, look at that. Nice. I don't think I've ever seen a live one. What do we have? Is that our orange spot? Yes, sir. Nice. It's not a very common. Are you searching for Topekas right now, or? No. Just kind of. Trying to get all the, all the fish know, in one location. Really fish in the front. Yeah. I'm just trying to get all the fish in the back so you can get it up. Look at that. Whew. That's a big I don't know, a little bullhead. Nice. Fish for days. Alright. That's incredible. Did I disappoint you or? Not at all, man. This is awesome. Just start piling them in here or what? Now it's time to go through all of these fish one by one and identify them to the species. Uh, at the end here we had about 15,000 individuals that we ID'd, um, so pretty incredible. And we also found some Topeka Shiners, so stay tuned. Identifying every single fish down to the species is a long, arduous, and tedious process but is very necessary and um, provides very important information to the abundances of the different fish species that are found in the oxbow and particularly rare species such as Plains Top Minnow uh, and the Topeka Shiner which in particular we were after today.
of our fin clips, so we're gonna release our Topekas now back in the oxygen.